In the lab downstairs, we have what's known as a mass spectrometer. And this is essentially a very sensitive way of determining the weight of a geologic sample. And not just the sample itself, but of certain elements within that sample. And so what we have to do down there, because the mass difference is so small, is we have to go through a pretty um, involved procedure of purifying the element of interest, um, turning it into something that we can actually analyze on that mass spectrometer, and then doing the analyses on the, on the mass spectrometer. And because nothing's ever perfect, um, eventually your analyses get less and less precise, and you have to do what we were doing the other day when you came in, which is kind of turn the thing off and tear open its guts and give it a good cleaning inside and then put it back together and hope that everything works. It's like the world's um, most uh, poorly designed Lego set because not only are the pieces about ten times smaller than any uh, Lego set that you've ever dealt with, but half of them are magnetic and there are big magnets there so as soon as you undo one piece it flies off. But if you're careful, you're able to um, take it apart, and then we just have to essentially treat it like a jeweler would treat a watch. Uh, we polish up each piece very carefully and wash it and then dry it and then hope that we haven't lost a piece so that when we reassemble this um, internal source, it works again. Fortunately, you only have to do that about every three years or so. It'll take at least two weeks. So you're there, you don't drink much coffee because when you drink coffee, your hand does this. So you like to work with people who have small fingers.